guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing fine because i'm doing good i'm doing so good so on today's video we'll be doing like a very very minimalistic porridge plantain and very very easy as you can see we don't have so many ingredients and easy like very straightforward we have a plantain on ripe plantain you can use ripe plantain if you want but i prefer using on ripe plantain for this recipe we have our country onion some seasoning cube and we have some white pepper we have black pepper we have onion we have palm oil guys palm oil some salt yes who cooks without salt <laughs> and then we have some dried pepper and this is all we need for this recipe guys all so right now we'll go ahead to clean to wash my plantain chop it and put in a pot so stay tuned guys in washing it to the end so guys at this point i've gone ahead to wash um, and clean my plantain so i'm going to chop it into like smaller sizes little chunks like this is like for it to be very flavorful and also for it to like cook fast and like this is the recipe I want to make so it's like little little chunks like according to what you want and guys once I'm cooking those one plant I just want to cook those a single plate of food <laughs> So guys, this is what we have. I'm going to chop it into my thing. I'm going to add it to our pot. And then I'm adding like as much meat as I want. Then at this point, I'm going to turn on the heat. So I've turned on the heat and I'm going to cover our pot. So while our planting is like cooking, I'm going to chop our onions and then add them to the pot. So here is our onion. I'm going to chop into very, very little sizes, tiny sizes. So guys, this is what I have after chopping the onion. Like this is too much. I'm not going to add in everything, just a little bit. So I'm going to add in bit of onion to the pot and then I order like spicy so that I can cook together with it. It's a one pot kind of thing so you don't need to do much. <laughs> Seasoning cube, black pepper, pepper, dry pepper. And this is like a very very key spicy like country onion just take the taste to another level a little bit of country onion white pepper bit of salt and then palm oil guys palm oil is to give it like a very yellow coloration at the end of the day you're going to look at you're going to see the soup will look like really yellow because of the palm oil and <coughs> for those who are worrying saying like oh you chop the onions isn't like are you not going to see chunks of onions when you the food is ready no you're not going to see because when onion cooks properly it actually melts in the pot so you're not going to see any chunk of onion at the end so guys this is what we have all we have to do now is just to wait for our food to get ready and while it's cooking and as the water like boils away you have to check the pot to, to see if you have to add in water more water or not and also like when you add in water 
also taste for seasoning to see if like the season is okay so that you don't at the end of the day have a tasteless meal so guys at this point we are almost done so i'm just going to wait for like 20 to 30 minutes because this is plantain and i prefer my plantain to be really cooked and also you get like the taste of plantain when it's actually really cooked and this one is also so so tasty and flavorful because we chop the plantain into little little chunks so like all the juices are going to enter into every corner of the like little chunks of plantain you get what i mean <laughs> and guys thank you so much for your likes thank you for your subscription thank you for your comments i thank you like it's true that my community is not like a really big community but i'm grateful for you guys like you're the real mvp ah i cannot even i cannot even lie i cannot even lie i cannot so i'm so grateful and thank you guys please watch my like um the advertisements on my videos we are monetized now so we have some ads that will be going on please watch thank you so much and see you you see it's like it's beginning to boil as you can see yeah 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 later guys guys let's check on our box like you see the water is almost dry, but I'm going to add in some water. I want to cook like really, really well, really, really well. You see what I was talking about um, using the palm oil? You see how yellow it looks? So I'm going to taste to know if I can add in. Like more seasoning. Yeah, guys, I need more seasoning. Mm. Salt and seasoning cube too. So I'll go ahead and add in a little bit of like seasoning cube again and then a little bit of salt, just a little bit. Guys, not exaggerate on the quantities. It's better to add than it's better to put little than to put much. Like take note guys, that's a cooking hack. <laughs> better to even put in like little like less than put much in terms of water seasoning and all because when you put less you can easily add it the way you put more i don't know how you're going to do to remove it all <laughs> so guys you're almost done you can see like the plantain has cooked already some of them like have broken i've gotten broken into little into smaller chunks so it's cooking at this point i feel like we have to wait for just like some few minutes and then our food will be ready So guys, at this point, our food is ready. Wow, voila, this is what we You see? You see the consistency? How thick? Guys, very easy to make. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys on my next video. Thank you. Guys, please like, comment, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. As you can see, you see why? Right? Like, the, like there are no chunks of onions in it because it's like it melted in the soup while it was cooking. So thank you guys so much again. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs>